Hello and welcome to Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town, where it is day four of spring and no birthdays today. Good morning, Snowdrop. Let's get a peach for Lizette. Good morning, honey. Howdy. Good morning, Heather. Let's give today our best. Yeah, let's. <laughs> and while we're here, let's make pancakes. Or Mikey. And pasta for Jay. Um, not Jason. Uh, Dunhill. Good morning, Magnolia. Let's put the uh, gifts away, the pancakes and the pasta. these fish and sea creatures and go see what's up in our summer garden. Nothing to harvest, really. We do have some seeds though. Let's put the seeds into here. Oh, and we also need to make zucchini and red pepper seeds. It was summer garden day today, wasn't it? I think so. It's just weird that only the trees are harvestable. Oh well. I think the last time I played I visited the spring garden. Oh well. Let's get all of these harvested. And let's go back to the farm. This time, I am going to put all of that stuff into the fridge. Because we have so many fish and sea creatures to sell. That, um, I think the shipping bin is going to be overflowing as it is. Even without these taking up extra space in there. And of course we'll make the uh, cacao into cocoa powder. And while we're here, let's see about the flower situation. Got some tulips. And let's make seeds. We also have some mushrooms. And let's make spores.
we also have some honey. Well, honey hive, royal hives, wow. We also leveled up to eight in uh, beekeeping, became a master beekeeper. The tulip situation here is pretty good, so I think we can use these to get more honey hives into the making. And yeah, this is pretty exciting because I don't think we've got royal hives before. Wow. Let's take the mushrooms into the fridge. Oh, also, forgot to put the royal hives into the honey maker. Well, we'll just have to go back there and do that. Also, I'm kind of thinking of maybe making another honey maker for us to, so that we can then put all of the honey into honey makers or all of the honey hives into the honey makers like at once and we won't have to keep six of them in our inventory waiting for the next day just a little convenience quality of life thing Let's see what the Earth Sprites have for us today. So this is not a Journey Sprite day, alright? And I don't think those were anybody's, well, uh, Dunhill's or Jason's or um, Mikey's favorites because those three people plus Sydney are the only ones who we still need to raise our heart levels with. Pretty cool that we are getting so close to being at 10 hearts with everybody. I guess we could keep that pansy. Also, I was thinking, um, we could make one more chest. We have so much stone in here. And, um, we could put it uh, somewhere in our first farm area to kind of prevent um, debris from spawning. And also we could use the chest to store fish fish that we catch with our nets oh of course these take four spaces well um We'll put it We'll put it over here. Yeah, this is not a bad place for it. We just need to clear out a few things. And we'll put it next to the uh Yeah, right there. She 
Bing Bin is getting close to full already. So we can't put any chests to where I was going to put them. Um, I guess we could put some stone lanterns there. These are one of the very few outdoors decor items that can be placed in like small spaces. I really wish there were more outdoor decor items that could go into small spaces. I guess I've been pretty spoiled by games like Stardew Valley. Oh well, let's just uh, drop these some place over here. Hmm. Maybe I'll move them a bit later, but that'll at least prevent a little bit of debris from spawning. Debris, trees, whatever. And it's very high time that we go and look after our animals. Ooh, careful, careful, Magnolia. You shouldn't come so close to me when um, I'm wielding my hammer. Hello, Ash. Jerry. Blossom. Willow. Arlo. Fern. Daisy. Dandelion. Ophelia. And Acacia. Thank you all so much for the fur and wool. Come on out. Hello Coco. Saffron. Haiku. Pepper. Geranium. Hibiscus. Ginger. Columbine. Sonnet. Thank you all so much for the milk. Come on out. Now that she cans, it's already very close to 5 p.m. Um, quite late. Maybe we'll just pet them and then let them out and then collect the eggs. Hello, Ruby. Chamomile. Nettle. Poppy. Um, Tulsi? No, I was trying to 
apricot, there we go, limerick, amethyst, crocus, and anise. Thank you all so much for the eggs. Come on out. Right. Hopefully they will have time to eat out there. They should, I think. I think we have experimented with this before, like way back when. And we've come to the conclusion that even a little bit of time is going to be enough. Now we need to process all of the animal products. here. Let's go sell what we can of the processed animal products. I know the shipping bin is quite full. Maybe we'll take some fish out and um, put them into the fish chest. need to go into the fridge. And once we've put these in here, we can go and um, start our round of socializing and gift giving. We just need to get the gifts from the chest here. And maybe we'll leave the pansies. Ah, grape juice. Let's give that pansy to Jason. And uh, pancakes to Mikey. Pasta to... Um, gosh. What's his name? Dunhill. This ought to be everything, and um, apparently we're not at uh, 12 and a half hearts with Lisette yet, because we didn't get the event. Either that or the uh, time of it is wrong on the website I was looking at. Dunhill, but I think it's more probable that we are still not quite at 12 and a half hearts. Ina, maybe tomorrow. Let's go and um, see about today's request and um, then visit Jason and Mikey at the hotel. Hello, love it. Not from Sydney. Oh, we have the title reward as well for the beekeeping level up.
Now let's go see Jason and Mikey. Jason? And Mikey? Now, let's go empty our inventory a little and then see what we've got in those nets that we placed um, yesterday. We'll make more of those, ten if we can, so that we can replace them as we pick them up. We'll put the town metal into the fish chest because it is going to be sold just like those fish and sea creatures. Now, let's see if we can make those nets. Do we only have 379? No, there's also a pile of 999. Cool. Let's make 50 twine. And put the rest of the grass back in there. Oh. I wonder if we can get to 20. Ah, uh, yes we did. Cool, 26 in fact. And we'll put the extras in here. Now I think we'll have to wait a couple of days until we can make another 10 of these giant nets uh, just because we are not going to have enough of the uh, durable lumber until, until then. It's going to take a couple of days for the makers to make it. I see we're kind of getting um, the same stuff that we've been fishing up, except for the ore fish. That's new, and I think it was required for like a recipe or two. So nice. Yeah, salmon, sardines, dosnapper, milkfish, herring. I do see that they are maybe a bit better quality though. Maybe it's a coincidence, maybe not. But I don't think there were any two star things there. Yeah, these are all... Well, okay, there was a three star thing and then four star as well. So, yeah, I don't think it improves the star quality to fish with the giant net. Anyway, wow, it's 11pm already. Um, 
I think that actually raised our fishing skill quite visibly, right? So maybe this could be a thing we do every couple of days. Let's wish our cats good night. And maybe we could cook that or fish dish. Whatever it was. Was it a soup? Yeah, it was. Or fish soup. So that's one more dish we'll have cooked. That we hadn't cooked before. I don't know if I'm going to bother cooking all of the dishes in our cookbook. One more soup. Lobster and mussel. Alright. Hmm. We'll see about maybe perhaps possibly one day cooking all of those. Um, but for now, thank you so much for spending time with me here on the Mellow. It was lovely to have you. If you'd like to show some support, please leave this video a like and perhaps a comment too. I'd really appreciate that. And if you're not already subscribed, then please do subscribe to conveniently keep up with my content and to show me that you want to keep watching my videos. Remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day and I'll see you next time.